And in relationship to Alzheimer's, they're calling it the new aluminum because aluminum is also toxic to the brain with Alzheimer's, but so is copper. And then number 10 is copper. Now listen, we need copper, okay? We need zinc. We need all these trace minerals. But if you're taking the cheap version in higher amounts, it can be very toxic. It's very important with a copper zinc ratio. We need 10 times as much zinc to copper and we need to kind of keep it in that ratio for everything to work. Because if you're taking a lot of zinc, that can create a copper deficiency. If you're taking a lot of copper without zinc, that can mess up your zinc as well. But too much copper can flip things from being an antioxidant and create oxidation. The amyloid placking in Alzheimer's, inflammation in your brain. And in relationship to Alzheimer's, they're calling it the new aluminum because aluminum is also toxic to the brain with Alzheimer's, but so is copper. So too much copper in the wrong form ends up accumulating in your brain and in your liver. Get your trace minerals, especially copper, from shellfish or liver or dark chocolate. And if you do take copper, make sure you take it with the other trace minerals in the right combination.